getting fucked. That's what it's all about. Getting fucked up, fucked over, fucked around with, or just play good old-fashioned fucked. And you guessed it if you said that the biggest dick of all was some inarticulate, all-American moron asswipe who will eat shit and accept it sucks. As long as it's sugar-coated, tax-deductible, and you don't have to think about it twice. And the less you think, the more they like you anyway. While that old, overemployed, undereducated, ham-fisted fruitcake sits humping a torpedo ready to just blow your ass away. And I'm sitting on a bomb, too. A time bomb. But before I explode, I just wanted to talk about the obvious problems of being a citizen of the world, where the so-called benefits of the rodeo mind stretch across a continent too fucked up to realize that it's making the biggest nosedive in perhaps its entire existence. The liars, the thieves, or the idiots take your pick. I ain't picky. And obviously neither is the rest of this semi-somnambulistic asshole society that's on the verge of virtual collapse. Considering that fatal blend of ignorance and arrogance and the general all-around abuse of power, it's no wonder we're suffering from the constitutional blues. Their toughest job, of course, is keeping a straight face as they lie through their false teeth, choking on the words that somebody else wrote for them in order to overcompensate for their own incredible intellectual paralysis. Well, the way I look at it, the world is overrun with hot-headed, power-hungry, greedy men. Fuck. Fuck.